that said in part, as of 1 January 1863, all those who are held in bondage in states in rebellion against the Union are henceforth and forever free. And then he had one little section in there that said that black men would be allowed to do what white men can do in this country. They can take up arms to defend their wives, their children, their families. A friend of mine, I was still living in Rochester at that time, uh, John Andrew was governor of the state of Massachusetts, and Massachusetts was granted the privilege to raise the first free black regiment in the North. Major Stearns, George Stearns, was put ahead of that effort. I was employed as one of the recruiters, and back my first two boys were my first two recruits in the state of New York. Where went quite successfully until um, certain promises were not kept.